Things are heating up with the Tholians. Monitor stations are detecting large fleet movements toward Federation space, and they're refusing all of our diplomatic hails. We're doing all we can to prevent a war, but it's not looking good. I want you to join a task force I'm assembling. If this goes south, I want my best people on the front line when it does. Stay safe. Federation shouldn't be having significant issues with the Tholians at this point in time. I've been scanning the timeline, and I think I've found the problem. Two years ago, a Tholian colonial fleet was destroyed. The Tholians blamed the Federation, and increasing hostilities have ultimately led us here. This is something I'll need your help to correct. Okie dokie. I've pinpointed the incident in question. Setting temporal transponder. We've arrived in 2268, and not a moment too soon. The Nakul are clearly out for blood. Tholians were being hailed by the Defiant. I'll remind you that our orders forbid us from telling them anything specific about the situation. Good to see you. We're in a real tight spot here. The Tholians were taking a serious beating when we reached the system, and the other ships opened fire on us the minute we dropped out of war. Mind lending Thank us a you. hand until we figure out what's going on? Casualties are in the thousands. Jesus Christ. Vengeance for the children. Really, is that the reason why the Thoians are in the time war?
Don't suppose you have any idea what's going on here? There's nothing on these aliens in our computers or why they'd attack the Tholians, or us for that matter. All right, do what you need to do. We'll talk about all of this when the shooting stops, deal? Yeah, sure. I know it doesn't feel great keeping information from the Defiance crew, but believe me, it's for the best. I'll monitor. I found appropriate transport coordinates on the Tholian flagship. Hopefully you can convince them that we're not at fault here. If the Tholians go to war with the Federation now, it would be devastating on a galactic scale. Oh, good EV suits. These are fun. These are fun. <laughs> Reading only a few Tholian life signs. I'm detecting numerous knuckle life signs. The four are on the way. Knuckle reinforcements are on their way to your position. Stay alert. I know, I'm working on it, Jesus Christ.
Quinn! Say the Quinn! God save the Quinn! Tholian Queen's progress. She hasn't been able to send the signal to her people. Orders? Okay, let's have a little chat. What's the situation here? Where did those alien ships come? And I don't need to know, right? I read you, but it doesn't mean I have to like it. That big alien ship is here they come! Come <laughs> on. 
a tough little ship. God damn it, it's just directly behind me, I can't get around! Reduction to shields not helping. Alright, I'm gonna shot. Dreadnought. Federation, you have proven you are different. Rational. This pleases us. We have sent word to our sisters. The Naku will pay. The Federation will not. Now. Oh! Vengeance for our children. You know. I was really confused of why the Tholians want to fuck up Nakul in the beginning of the New Dawn. But this makes perfect sense now, that Nakul sealed their own fate. The Queen's message has been sent through subspace and... Yes! The timeline is correcting itself. Good work. Now, we just need to help with... Oh no. The Queen is going to full impulse. She's gonna ram the Nakul Dreadnought! This is how you be a badass, by the way. Our engines are still down! We can't escape! This is their fate. This is one of the hardest things about being a temporal agent. We can only make the changes we have to make, not the ones we want to make. I'm afraid there's not. History states that the Defiant went missing, only to be found here weeks later by the Enterprise. Though they're lost, we now know that they played an important role in keeping the Federation safe, in protecting the timeline. For what it's worth, I will be sure their heroism is included in my report. The Tholians will remember this as well. This encounter may lead them to be more inward focused, avoiding conflicts with the Federation for the time being. At the very least, they will know that it wasn't the Federation that was responsible for the destruction of their colony convoy. Captain Archer had similar concerns when I worked with him. We often disagreed, but in the end, 
we were able to work past our differences and do the right thing. I hope you and I can do the same. Leaving Defiant to her fate was a hard choice, but it saved untold billions of lives. That has to count for something. Until next time.